welcome back to my channel welcome back to another installment of my supermarket series and today we are shopping Aldi and Lidl I'm going to combine the two because I feel like I definitely compare and contrast the two all the time do you have a preference let's run this question in the comments below Aldi or Lidl which do you prefer I personally tend to opt for Aldi more often but you can't beat the Lidl bakery section so that's what draws me into Lidl. So today I have a bag of goodies from the sort of middle of Lidl section and the Aldi special buys. So where should we start Lidl or Aldi? I feel like I have more from Aldi. Let's just go with Aldi shall we? Are you even an Aldi or Lidl shopper if you don't leave? with the brochures for a little browse through when you get home. Honestly, one of my favorite things to do, <laughs> make a coffee, get home and have a flick through, see what's new in Special Buys and then end up heading back out to try and find what you didn't already buy. Anyway, I'm gonna start with Aldi. I will just say there is a lot of construction noise going on right now upstairs and outside. If you hear that, I'm sorry, we're mid renovations and honestly, my life right now is just all surrounded by building noises. That's just what I'm used to. It's almost like tuned into my brain. Oh God, that is loud, isn't it? So I have been after a cake stand, a glass cake stand for the longest time, but just never really found the right one, found they've been too expensive, thought I'll just wait until the future when our kitchen's ready and then maybe invest into a nice one. And then Aldi brought out this for 9.99. I was so happy to find this. I just like the plain simplicity of the design. Love this so much and I love the price point of only 9.99. So I had to pick this one up. I also saw these for 12.99. They're a pair of ribbed vases. We all know I'm obsessed with this kind of ribbed glassware detail. I love that. And these were 12.99. Now I have since seen online like on the special buy section that these actually come in clear as well. I've found the smoked version which is almost like a, a dark grey. I love the look with the eucalyptus in it as well. Anyway, 12.99 for a set of two. We have a meat carving board which I bought from I think it was Home Sense years ago now and there is a slight crack down it and I spotted this in Aldi for 10.99 so it's a meat carving board which means it's got this kind of texture running throughout the middle to allow the juices to kind of flow textured on one side but also plain and simple on the other should you wish to just use it as like a serving platter board or just a chopping board so regular viewers all know i have a bit of a stockpile of cards and gift wrap i like to collect as and when i see things that i like so aldi have a range of gift cards which are 99p each and there are oh god this one which says birthday girl on it and little flecks of gold and then this one with like a nice birthday cake just says happy birthday to you and then we have a heart shaped wreath and this is very like white company style so i thought that was quite simple minimal and it's blank as well so maybe a nice sort of thank you card or a thinking of you type card and then this one i thought was fun it says let the celebrations begin with almost like a hendrix style gin glass and bottle on there so yeah 99p each they were sticking with sort of stationery they have a new eco range as well with loads of kind of like bamboo products um plain cardboard and yeah i decided to pick up two things from the range this first one is a notebook which just says get stuff done and they had one with different quotes on these are all 199 each and then i also stopped up on some pencils and these are really fun because they've got little quotes on them so you get a pack of 10 and it says like change the world make the change stay true to yourself and then i've seen these for a while now they have these journals they have a sleep journal a i think it's a food journal and a yoga journal or is it tra i think it's travel actually not food i loved the look of this one the nice and simple gray 2.99 so really affordable and it includes some stickers inside as well i was just quite keen to get back into doing some yoga and i thought it might be quite fun to actually journal the process then moving on to some other kind of eco-friendly products that they had and i picked both of these up so this first one is a produce bag it's a two pack of 100 percent organic cotton and they have little quotes on they had ones with varying quotes i love the font of this as well this one says carry your own carry bags and it's just a little like drawstring 
bag. And I quite like to, as they have store fruit and veg in them as well. And it was 2 dollars Then I saw this as well, which was also 2 dollars um, In the same section, again, 100% organic cotton. And this one is a set of three small dishcloths. It's a shame they're not all that colour because I would have loved that. But they had ones with blues in. I went with the greens just because I really want to incorporate kind of greens into this home. I love the fact that we're going to be looking onto this garden, which I'm currently looking at right now outside the window. There's lots of greenery. There's huge trees which we're going to be keeping. Shrubbery, bushes, a lot of which we are removing. But a lot we are keeping as well. So there's going to be lots of greenery outside that we open up from the kitchen doors into the garden. So I wanna incorporate some greens um, into the kitchen and I thought these would be really nice, kind of natural way to do that. So yeah, three pack of dishcloths at 2 dollars Then from the kind of Jo Malone dupes section that they have, I picked up this hand wash and hand and body lotion from um, the kind of beauty section in the scent number three pomegranate. I think they've slightly changed up the packaging. It's kind of like a frosted look now. I actually prefer it. So these come in at £2.49 each and they do smell really, really good. So I'm gonna put these in our kitchen. And then at £1.49, they've now introduced uh, hand gels, which even Jo Malone haven't done. I've been to Jo Malone since. They had hand gel in Jo Malone dispensers and I was like, oh, do you sell them? And they said, no, not yet, but maybe in the future we will. So um, yeah. Aldi have beat them to it. So I picked up two scents. I went for the number three pomegranate again, but I also went for the number one lime basil and mandarin. Again, another Jo Malone dupe. Last of the kind of beauty items, I picked up this rose water Missler cleansing water. Love the branding that Aldi have done with this one. It's definitely, you know how they do a lot of beauty dupes inspired. I've done a whole video about it before. So I thought I would pick it up to try. So yeah, pick that one up and that one was only £1.29. Last of the homeware finds for Aldi and I picked up this rubber pet mat to put Barney's bowls on top of. So it was only £3.99, easy to clean, 100% silicone, hard wearing and yeah, it just helps keep the uh, bowls in place but also helps keep the floor keep a little bit cleaner. Uh, like drier, you know, when he's drinking. So anyway, 3 dollars A couple of food and drink items from Aldi, not too many to show you, but I wanted to pick up this because it sounded delightful, either on its own or as a mixer with gin. It is their Ridge of Valley Premium Cucumber and Mint Flavoured Light Tonic Water. So the fact that it's light tonic water is always a go-to for me. I always go for the lighter option, so it's zero calorie. But cucumber and mint, how nice does that sound? Okay, this is definitely a naughty little purchase, but I saw the image and couldn't resist. So it's a white chocolate chip blondie mix. I love brownies, love blondies even more. I'm definitely more of a white chocolate kind of gal. And these are new, so they make 16 brownies, blondies in this case. I always find with these uh, lazy bake kits, I like to call them, that they always say like makes 16. The way that I cut them up, it makes like maybe four to six, because I like them big chunky pieces. This was only £1.49. Then I found two spreads that sound absolutely delightful. This first one, it says I'm new on it as well. And it's a biscuit spread, the crunchy version. So I'm guessing this will be like the Lotus Biscoff spread. And I've never actually tried the Lotus one in the crunchy version, I've never found it. So the fact that I have the kind of dupe, I'm excited to try this, good in baking as well. And this one was £1.79. And then I spotted this at £1.49, which again has the little I'm new label sticker thing on it. And this sounds a bit of me. It's a white chocolate flavour cookie spread. So I think this will be like um, the kind of middle of the Oreo. So I'm excited to just literally get a spoon and eat this straight out of the jar. So that's everything I picked up from Aldi. Now moving on to Little. I, first of all, the first thing I actually got and made me go back and get a trolley was this this laundry basket i loved the look of this so if you can see on the front there the design it's got like all the different symbols and meanings for laundry different wash what they all mean basically now they did have different designs of these laundry baskets 
they had some with quotes on like all in this color with the rope handle but with different designs on the front this is the one that stood out to me most only 5.99 this one was now i did get a fashion -y item it was in the sale from 7.99 down to 5.59 and i did size up to a medium which is a 12 to 14 because i think the one the small was 8 to 10 and i'm usually like maybe stay more 10 to 12 so i sized up anyway and it's got this little button de design and kind of wrap over front super soft fabric the little button down design are in like little tortoiseshell buttons and and they are seamed shut so nice and secure bargain little sale find there little two have the gift card section and i saw this little beige and gold happy birthday card which i decided to pick up on P pick up on pick up and again their gift cards are only 99p oh another sale clothing item that i totally forgot to mention from 349 down to 244 this one was and it was actually from the men's section it's just one of their sports tops sports vests i got it in a small but I thought this would be really handy to throw on to go to the gym. Signed up to a local pure gym now that they're back open and now that we don't have a bathroom. That is my current bathroom situation is just going to the gym every day. So, every other day. Saw this at $4.99 and just picked it up and thought I'll find a use for this somewhere, somehow. So, it's actually an organic cotton sleeping bag liner so it was in the camping section the kind of outdoor garden section but i just loved the material of it so much that i thought it's like comes in at like a little bag and i thought this would be really nice either as like a tablecloth or as a throw like over the sofa or in barney's bed or something i just love the fabric of it so much it's so soft love the color as well that i just thought for 4.99 i'm gonna find a use for that somewhere somehow i didn't even know sleeping bag liners existed these were reduced down to 14 <laughs> Lovely. These are reduced down to 49p and they had them in black and neutral colour. String shopper bag. Um, and then I also picked up this jute, um, I don't even know what its intended purpose is. It's jute strip for in the garden section. It's a really thick jute band that I thought would be really good for making with big ribbons with and tying for gift wrap. So this was only 199. Then the other kind of household item I got was this microfiber cloth from the W5s. It's their own brand, I think. And I usually get the minky glass cleaning ones, the green, and I really like them. So I decided to try this one out. You get a pack of two for £1.15, which usually I think the minky ones are about £3 for one. So if these are a good alternative, they are much cheaper. And then the other last few bits that I got are foodie items. So I'll just whiz through these. I got a triple chocolate crisp cereal. This is so good. I got some crisps. These are like the kind of kettle chip dupes, the ridge cut sea salt, the Ritter Sport chocolate, divine. So they have these huge ones in little. I've never had one this big before. I usually get the mini ones. This one is the praline flavor, which is my fave. So I had to pick that one up. And then they were doing like an Italian week or something. So they had these Filippi, Filippo Berrio extra virgin olive oil and mild and light and color olive oil sprays so i've never tried the spray you usually get the regular olive oil that they do and then last but not least a trusty favorite of mine the nescafe gold sachets the coffee sachets never seen the flat whites before when i'm out and about i quite often get a flat white so i'm excited to give these ones a try i guess they're going to be a bit shorter but um yeah we'll let you know how i get on with them if i end up repurchasing at some point then we'll know that it was a success like my cinnamon latte ones that I seem to get every time I go to the shops if I see them. So that is everything that I picked up from Middle of Lidl and Aldi Special Buys. Do let me know which were some of your faves. Thank you so, so much for watching this video. Thumbs up if you enjoyed it and I hope to see you all very, very soon in my next one. Bye guys.